I'm from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Yeah! Oh, come on, nobody cares. <laughs> nobody cares, and I know that you guys don't care. Because whenever I mention I'm from Minnesota, I get caught in a 45-minute long conversation about the movie Fargo. <laughs> oh, yeah. And it just gets worse from there. I say Minneapolis, then you ask me what it's like in Indiana. It's okay. Uh, I currently live in Los Angeles, and trust me, it was a culture shock for me. Because I don't know if you guys can tell, just by looking at me, but back home in the soda, I'm like a 10. <laughs> I'm glad that was funny. <laughs> and then I move out here, and now I'm more like a, uh, I don't know, a strong four. You know, I went from a plethora of options of happiness to a um, couple more drinks, you'll do. <laughs> I told that story this one time, and this guy comes out to me after the show, and he goes, hey, Nicole, you're at least a seven. <laughs> I said, well, that's, that's cool. I mean, coming from a negative three, that puts me right back at the four, doesn't it? <laughs> Yahtzee! Uh, uh. <laughs> so uh, I think I'm single. Is that, is that a weird statement to say, I think I'm single? I don't know, you guys, help me out. If it involves the police, is it over? <laughs> you know, and it, it's, it's probably a good thing because it was a little bit abusive. And if you knew me personally, that's shocking, you know? And trust me, I was surprised too when he hit back. <laughs> You know, I had this deal going on for a good year. I, you know, I kind of thought maybe he liked it. I don't know. <laughs> and you know, it's tough being on my own. I mean, I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay, but trust me, it's really, really hard. You know, when you don't have somebody there to take it all out on. <laughs> you know? 